Hello, my name is Mark, and this is my video lecture about the sum and difference of cubes. Okay, so sum and difference of cubes. We have two formulas: one for the sum and one for the difference. So if we have two numbers cubed, we can call them a a cubed plus b cubed, and we want to factor them. Okay, then the way we factor is a plus b a squared minus a b plus b squared. We have a cubed minus b cubed, it's a minus b, a cubed plus a b plus b cubed. And one way to memorize the signs here is one acronym is MOP, which is match, opposite, and positive. So the sign in this first pr set of parentheses will match this sign. This will always be the opposite of that sign. And then the last one will be positive, and you see that also checks out for the uh, for the addition of cubes as well. Okay, then. So let's look at number one. If I have x cubed plus one, looking at that first formula, I first need to figure out what was cubed to give me x cubed. Obviously, x. And then what was cubed to give me one? Well, one. And that's a plus. Okay, and then here I put, I square that first component, so it's x squared. I multiply these two together, so that's 1 times x, which is just x. Okay, and then I square 1, well, what's 1 squared? Well, that's 1. Okay, let's look at number 2. So in number two we have what? Eight cubed minus twenty seven. Uh eight a cubed minus twenty seven. So let's look how we're gonna work this one. Well what number do we have to cube to get to eight? Well that's two. And then obviously a variable cubed is just itself. What do you have to cube to get to 27? Well, 3. 3 times 3 times 3 is 27. And then that's a minus. Okay. And then the first component of the second set of parentheses is I square 2a. Well, 2a, if you square it, 2 squared is 4, and then a squared is a squared, so that's 4a squared. Okay. Then I multiply these two together, so 2a times 6 is a 6a. And then I square 3, well 3 squared is 9. And you notice it's following the acronym of MOP. I match these signs, that's opposite, and that's a positive. Okay, so the acronyms are holding, match, opposite, and positive. Let's look at number three. C cubed plus 64. So that's a C cubed plus 64. Once again, anytime you cube a letter, okay, well, you want to find the cube root, obviously it's itself. Okay. And then 64, well, the cube root of that is what? Four. And then now I square C. I multiply the two together. And then I square 4. And once again, I'm using the mop. I match the signs, right? I match those signs. Opposite. And then the last one is always positive. Okay, so this has been my video lecture about the sum and difference of cubes. You can find me online, www.supergenius99.com. Thank you for listening.